All right, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for uh, coming to my daily check-in video and watching this. Uh, I finally got everything connected. I finally figured out how to get all this uh, video conferencing, recording stuff working. And uh, my hope is that we can use this kind of as a way for you to see my face every day and get some in, you know, extra instruction from me so that um, as you guys go through the day, and first, take care of your family, take care of any things at home you need to, but also get some of your schoolwork done and try to stay on top of things. So I've been kind of going back and forth as to whether I want to give you guys uh, content assignments just yet. And for right now, I think it's best if we kind of just uh, maybe have some activities where we all just learn about the, the you know, a little bit, do more of a little bit of a deep dive into what's happening around us. And um, I also have um, uh, like a video conferencing meeting set up for two o'clock today. So if anybody's online at two o'clock today, I want you guys on the Canvas page, you'll see a link for Zoom. I want you guys to log in and you'll actually be able to interact with me with all of my other students. So biology and human anatomy students alike, whoever wants to log in is welcome to come and, and, uh, and join us. I would like you guys today to um, read the Newzella article I assigned. I want you guys to read it at your Lexile level you're comfortable with, and then I want you to answer the quiz questions and then complete the right problem. Now, the article is about coronavirus, and it's not meant to scare you. Remember I said it's not about fear, it's about information. So. I don't want anybody being more afraid than they already are, because I'm sure some of you are. Um, from your comments that you guys sent in on the first assignment, those are my two lovely dogs. You'll probably hear those throughout all of these videos, so get used to it. Let me shut the door here. Anyway, it's something I have to get used to. What I'd like you guys to do is just kind of learn about why we're locking in here what we're really scientifically trying to accomplish here, which is the idea of flattening the curve. So take some time today between now and 2 o'clock to um, not only relax. I always want to remind you guys, we need to, we need to remind ourselves to relax in times like this. But read that article, complete the quiz questions, do your writing prop. I'll try to read through those while I'm eating lunch today and hopefully you guys will have those done for me and then we can have a nice little conversation after a class session. And if other questions come up, great. I'll answer what I can. Um, and if it just turns into a place where we want to talk, then that works too. Okay? Because really what, what we need to remember is there's a lot of uncertainty right now for everybody. Okay? And, um, it is important not to get scared about the uncertainty. Um, even though fear is uh, usually the first emotion that we go to when things like this happen, and that's okay. Nothing wrong with fear. But we have to try to use our rational mind to try to think through that fear. So I want you guys to, to learn a little bit more about what's going on, and then we can talk about it. All right? So uh, if there's any questions, guys, please email me. I'm noticing a lot of people still aren't getting on Canvas yet, so if you know anybody that isn't on Canvas yet or doesn't have internet access, please let me know so I can reach out to them, I can call them, and I can figure out what they need. All right, guys, um, read the Newzella and be ready at 2 o'clock for our conference. Talk to you later, guys. Take care. Bye.